This video blog is on a test I did to see if using a question in the subject line of an email would result in a higher open rate than just using a statement. This test was completed uh, last week, April 8th and 9th. It was an email for a customer of mine who basically he can what he does is he puts a company's logo on anything. In this particular case, it was for um, an offer to put your logo on polo shirts. Here's an example of what the email actually looked like on the inside. So you can see we're trying to sell shirts. There's an offer to save money if you buy a certain quantity. Got some information on the company. Um, anyways, that's what the email was. And going in, I uh, kind of assumed that the question subject line would have a higher open rate than the statement. So you can see here the one subject line is unique embroidery, do you want a deal? Or unique embroidery, huge savings on shirts. This is definitely not always the case, but in this particular situation, I was right. As you can see on the first email sent on the 8th, the email with the question in the subject line had a higher open rate. And again on the Saturday, the question again had the higher open rate. So you can see right there. And what was also good to know was kind of overall how much the one outperformed the other. So if you look at the question email that was sent, there was 47 opens sent to 248 people. That equals an open rate of 19%. Now when we take a look at the statement version, this might take a little bit to write this out here, but um, it obviously had a lower amount of opens. That came in at 30. And that version of the email was sent to 234. So that gives us an open rate of 13% total for the statement email. So 19% versus our 13% for the statement works out to the question mark or the question in the subject line email returned a 46% higher open rate. So definitely a substantially higher open rate for the email with the question in the subject line. So based on these results, I would suggest that putting a question in your subject line of your marketing emails will more often than not result in a much higher open rate for your marketing emails. I think I'm still gonna test this again one more time and try and get a question and a statement that are more similar in wording as these two were slightly different. So I'm gonna test it again and see if uh, I get the same results. Thanks for watching this video and uh, please leave me a comment below letting me know what you think and rate this YouTube video. My name is Chris R. Keller and I work at ProfitWorks where I help small businesses generate new customers. Subscribe to this YouTube channel and subscribe to my blog at www.profitworks.ca backslash blog. If you're interested in getting more videos or articles related to generating new customers for B2B small businesses.